and welcome everybody here in Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube for some Iceborne Spiders, our last deck of the day. We're going to try out um, how Iceborne Legacy and Brood Awakening look with this new patch. Of course, we got Callista in here as well. So we're trying out some new cards. So Iceborne Legacy used to cost three mana and it was burst speed and all your allies got plus one, plus one. And they said that they tried, they wanted to make it more powerful and uh, to have it see more play in the metagame. And I actually am not sure, like that's what the, the patch note said, but I'm not sure they actually did that because turning it from burst speed to slow speed, I feel like just made it worse because um, now you have to target you know, like you target like one of Spiderling. Like basically our goal is to have Spiderlings. Like we're going to have, you know, Crawling Sensation, Hapless Aristocrat, um, Elise, Vile Feast, all those things make Spiderlings. And then of course our Brood Awakening, which this card is definitely better. It used to cost six, now it costs five. So we're trying to make uh, Spiderling, all of our Spiderlings everywhere, pump, it up, pump them up by plus two, plus two now. But it is a slow, slow uh, speed spell. Earlier in one of our games, we had an opponent um, cast an Iceborne Legacy on one of their spiders, and then we were able to, to, to just kill their spider with like a Vile Feast um, and just completely negate this spell. So we'll see. Um, yeah, I'm kind of not expecting it to be amazing, but, you know, we it's always good to, to play stuff and, and try it out, and uh, that's what we're going to do here. So I'll be your, your testing... Um, I'll be your, your test dummy here for you, and we'll see how good is Iceborne Legacy with Spider Wings. We also have the They Who Endure Atrocity combo, but that combo... Bleh. Combo's not something we want in our opening hand. We need some threats. Yeah, I've been I've been pretty pretty happy with the box with this card. Um, you know, four mana for three damage Come is a pretty good rate. Bite. You know, compare it to like grasp. It's five mana for three damage. Um, yeah, I've been I've been happy with this card. Alone. Alright, gonna try to save Elise. Yes. But you know, now like they play if they have um you know like a, a withering whale, we can't respond with our iceborne legacy to, to save stuff. I need no weapon. As death. I will play my part. This the stream's lagging. All right. Um, uh, did we try pack mentality? Not not in this deck, but we uh, the crimson deck that we had had pack mentality. But I haven't tried it in this deck. Okay, it's doing the lag lag thing again. I'm gonna try to reset my router after. I try to reset my router.
I don't know if this is a good trade for me. Honestly, maybe that's not even a good trade. That shouldn't even be. I should just be attacking them. Because that's right. My spiders are fearsome, so they can't block anyway. Ionia speaks through me. Fox kills the karma. It's good. Yeah, so the upload's complete, so it should so lag should be gone. If it's not, you can um uh no 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 wait wait. I guess gotta worry about ruination also, so let's go straight to attacks. So you, you can refresh if it's not if it's not gone, try refreshing. Where there is life, there is hope. My path is clear. An open heart teaches more than open eyes. Well, they're probably not. Probably not casting Ruination because they only got eight mana. Yeah, my internet se has seemed to to gotten worse. To been getting worse recently. Oh, I wonder if it's just like how everybody's staying home. I wonder if the internet's just worse because of that. Yeah, and yep, and it's been raining. That deny on my spiders was rough. Basically, they're going to have the five cards still in hand and at 10 life, and I'm going to be at 13 life with an Elise. Oh, I get the Spider 2. Never mind. I don't get that Spider 2. All right, so now what we need to do is draw a They Who Endure. My path is clear. Uh, that's, that's bad. 
now it's now it's just over. I don't know. They who endure. Come on, they who endure. Alright. Alright, own one. I wonder if I would have played my vial offering first if they would have denied the vial offering and then maybe I could have gotten the the other one to resolve. I'm not sure. Seem like we have a lot of spells in this deck. Yeah, that's that's what we're kind of that's what we're kind of trying out. Um, ourselves to see if um, you know to see with um, Iceborne Legacy but you're right it's probably going to be very weak with it being slow Six mana. Let's just get that card out of my hand. If I if I had one more mana, it would unfortunately cost seven to do Mark of the Isles and then Crawling Sensation and then Iceborne Legacy the the extra spiders. That would have been ideal. But that costs one too much mana. So keeping the Mark of the Isles means we can protect if we try to Iceborne Legacy something and then they have um, Mystic Shot in response. We can protect it with... The sun is shining. We should too. With the Mark of the Isles. in battle Yeah, possibly. The thing that's so strong about Iceborne Legacy is that it's just all those cards 
get plus two plus two any other time that you you know get us you know any other spiderling that will come in stand back I'll contain the threat who's the threat here magic corrupts the uh, from I wish I had mana for the wish I had mana for that card we haven't really had more spiderlings Mage Seekers are definitely good. A beacon through the dark. So letting them, like they're gonna do four damage or something anyway, letting them kill that so that I get to play a 6-6, six, six, they who endure, which Matches up pretty well against their things. I, I can have this Spiderling block the 6-5, and the 6-6 six, six can block other things. now yeah that cards looked good you just get a free detain detain's awesome magic stops with me Especially at this point of the game suspicious Got them down to two. If I had one more mana. Wait, I should have just played that instead of the. Oh no, because I need to play that to keep that thing alive. That's right. By the light. Wait. So if I would have just. No, because they were at seven. Yeah, I, ha I had the win there, didn't I? Well, we drew Atrocity, which could be good. No, because they have detained, so it's not. Well, we can't detain anymore. Wow. Shouldn't have won that. But okay, so I had the win. So basically, whenever they tapped out for that judgment, I needed to... I need to, my, the thing that was blocked by the 3-3, three, three, I need to pump it up with Mark of the Isles to make it an 8-8, eight, eight, and then um, cast the box to kill the 3-3 three, three that was blocking it. And then, and so it would have dealt 8 damage and they were at 7. So that was the line I needed to take to win. I didn't take that line, so then my opponent, um, you know, definitely should have just won. They could have just, you know, killed me and, Everything and had had the detain available. Could have just gone straight to attack, killed me. So I, oh wow, this camera is really delayed. Let me try to update it. Usually that updates it. I uh, don't want this yet, this yet, or that. Maybe that. Yeah, that updated the camera a little bit. Not really. Oh, 
Oh, spider. What's there we go. Point? Another day in the field. I must get out of here. There ever truly enough for I everyone. Like yours. You've no idea. Callista. Can Callista flip? Wait, oh, I can't cast, I can't cast Brood Awakening right now, can I? All right, yeah, we'll just block here. Obviously I can cast the box and kill Draven, but I'd rather just cast these two Arachnid Horrors. Let me change into something more comfortable. It's time to have these doing the damage first, but they're not really going to have a lifesteal thing, so it doesn't matter. And technically, I should have had both my one ones here, and then and had more damage, but it's fine. More for my collection. Ooh, quite a collection. We're gonna flip Callista. Let's see if there's any kind of cool animation. First time actually flipping Callista. That's pretty sweet. have nightmares over that animation obviously we do have the atrocity so we should just have this with atrocity i want to try to attack with callista first though let's make it deep uh fun's just they're just killing themselves with the with that Let's do that. Play the box. All right, we're about to be two and one. Cool animation, cool way to win the game.
All right, so we're two and one. Let's see, Ezreal Heimerdinger. I think I want to keep the Glimpse Beyond against the Ezreal Heimerdinger deck. No, I don't want the box. I guess it could kill an Ezreal or a Heimerdinger later. Why don't the spells have full art? Spells should have full art too. New cards. This is a good one. What do we think the chances of Iceborne Legacy resolving are? And them not killing my spider. It's got to be pretty low, right? I guess we'll just do this instead. Go ahead. Order, entropy, a never-ending cycle. Be a warning shot. You dare. Round and round and round it goes. We don't have the box kill any and all turrets. We must all make I thought you'd never ask. There we go. That's pretty good, getting rid of Ezreal and that turret. Not bad. There's just like no way these things resolve, right? I really want them to resolve. Yeah, this would be so much better as a as a three mana burst speed spell. Yeah, I like. I'm surprised that I'm surprised they thought they think that this is an upgrade. Like, not surprised by that, honestly. 
You won't suffer long. Ooh, they only got one mana. I think we're gonna be able to get this re to resolve. And get the other one to resolve also. Got some big spiders. Super spooky. And every other spy every spiderling that we're gonna play for the rest of the game just is gonna be a five five now. Get some more cards. Yes, yeah, so this is five mana, make three six fives, plus give all the rest of your creatures plus one plus zero. Ooh, okay, rummaging away the turrets. So what I need to be worried about with atrocity is I need to be worried about a frostbite spell. Hear that? Okay, well now they can't have a frostbite spell. You know I don't want to try that when they they play the three mana frostbite turn my thing into zero power. And then we don't kill them. Okay, we're three and one with the Iceborne Spiders. We actually got our, our Iceborne Legacies to resolve. That was pretty cool. Gotta wait for the opponent to tap out. Did for progress day. And 
sure let our spiders progress. And they rude the day. New hand. So facing some aggro. Team of Draven. <laughs> Progress day, the name of the deck. Reporting in. Swiftly. Demo always so excited. Playing the Arachnid Horror right now, it attacks for more, but we'll be able to. Uh, we'll be able to Vile Feast the next turn anyway. cost five i hope we draw something else that you know we get to use some more mana this next turn but i guess even if we don't banking mana is not so bad because these are all spells so that could be worse we need to bank the mana Is this is this Johnny Cash song? Johnny Cash song about sentences? You know, run on for a long time. Talking about like run on sentences. But sooner or later, you gotta cut them down. Those sentences. Now we're cooking. No. Static shock. Devastating. At least they didn't do it in response to the Iceborne Legacy, but still. Not good. Ugh. Just born legacy. No one's the wiser.
Attack. Got an axe with your name on this game, that Iceborne Legacy would have been miles better if it was what it what it was before. Where's my axe? I know what lurks in the shadows. Grow free. I guess I'm just going to cast this spell before it does nothing, because obviously this is the really important attack step here, is surviving this. First one's free. Let me change into something more. Come to her. Yeah, we, we've seen. Yeah, we've seen a few new bugs. Or like, you get like disconnected once. I'm guessing that last card is get excited because they didn't they didn't use these spinning axes. Or not. Mystic Shot. If their last card was Mystic Shot, they, sh they could have just had lethal by using the Spinning Axe and Mystic Shot, like, to kill me. Before even I drew or before the Puff Cap mattered or anything. So, presumably they drew Mystic Shot. But still, they should have used the Spinning Axe to do an extra point of damage to try to have the Puff Caps kill me. Yeah, they had to have drawn Mystic Shot. And so I got lucky with the drawn the Clutch Atrocity there. Should I trade my second Decisive Maneuver for my fourth Shadow Assassin? Yes. Sorry, Rex. Yes. Oh, sorry, Misters. You should. Yeah, my opponent's like, yeah, top deck. Unfortunately, I was also like, yeah, top deck. That's an egg. Did it move? Uh, reporting in? You won't get past me. Saying that, wait. 
Does Re Legion Rearguard say you won't get past me? Because it can't block. It's like how how does it? That's all things do is get past it. Yeah, that is actually kind of funny. It's like you can't do anything but get past it. makes their attacks pretty bad. <clears throat> Sorry, their blocks it makes their blocks pretty bad. Get me out of here. Hmm. You know, basically right now, debating on whether or not I want to use Elixir of Iron on any of these. I think we do. We'll, we'll use it on this one. Turn it into a 2-2. Well, I guess it's probably just going back to a 2-1 anyway, isn't it? My true beauty is beneath the skin. Good, we're not dead yet. Nine mana. So you know that one card that they have in hand still is a spell. surprised that we're doing this well with with our iceborne spider deck honestly i wasn't really expecting it we've still dropped 60 slots today we started today at 79 so we are um six games over 500 or you know like i guess record wise we're uh 21 and 21 and 15. 21 and 15 is a pretty solid win rate, and we still dropped a whole bunch. Karma Thresh. Do I want to keep this card? No, probably not. Just keep the Arachnid Horror. Those are not cards that I want either. These are not these are not cards that I want at all.
yeah, the box is just a pretty good removal spell. I've I've been very happy with it. It's it's been a, a good spell for us. We, we shall not rest until all betrays. I like that we drew this elixir of iron, and that is why. We got old school Callista, the 4 2 Callista. You know, like it kills Karma and Ezreal and Heimerdinger and all sorts of elusive creatures and aggro creatures. Gosh, our hand is not good. To Ionia, whatever the cost. See, the box is pretty good. This is so sad. All these Iceborne legacies and atrocities. Nothing to do. So sad. Luck had to run out at some point. We had won five in a row. Yeah, I don't think there's any way this works either. Karmas are going to give them a lot of life gain. My path is clear. An open heart teaches more than open. That's the the worst the worst our deck can look. Is that right there? Uh, 
I'm sorry, I moved. I was going to show how sprawled out you were, pup. Hammerlux. Do I want... Do I want Elixir of Iron to protect Elise? Yeah, I guess so. They, they play removal spells and everything, yeah. Oh, you want to mulligan this card away? How about you draw two more copies? That's what you wanted, right? I follow you anywhere. Of course you would. I shouldn't play this. I should just untap with that two mana because you know, they could add get excited right there. I didn't have elixir of iron to protect. Now you've gone and set it. Denounce magic. <laughs> Insolent cur. <laughs> Ziggy Stardust just came on while we were playing, playing some spiders. Let me change into something more comfortable. I hope no judgment. Oh come on, really? Really? I said that sarcastically. Come on. Yeah, we need to buff I-4 and Legacy. I had an idea, let's make it more unplayable than before. Yeah, it does buff up They Who Endure. Everywhere I go, the light follows. Seven mana. Who day? Last day of, of being self quarantined. Why is why is today the last day? You going back to work? Got us that sub goal too. Let's see. Uh, yep, you do. Yeah, so you go back to work tomorrow. Pushing my limit. Oh, you were in Mexico two weeks ago. Gotcha. Well, yeah, have have fun back at work. Uh, won't won't be as boring, of course. That's always good.
It's always good. <clears throat> so we're gonna trade here. We're trading a lot of spells just to get a little bit of damage in and keep keep a few creatures out. Things are now seven sevens though. Hmm. Now eight eights. They are at eight. So if we draw atrocity, atrocity? No, not iceborne legacy. Magic corrupts the mafia from within. Your demacia is nothing like what I know. This probably doesn't work, right? I hope it does. Oh, this spell never works. It's so slow. It's so slow. It never works. But yeah, good. We're in this together. Good thing you came back like just in time, though, Huday. You know, before any you know, travel restrictions or anything like that. Got back here in the country just in time. We drew it. Atrocity. Kill an ally to deal damage equal to its power to anything. This place reeks of foul magic. Rude. Hmm. But they got to detain. So I can't cast this until they cast the detain. But if they just don't cast detain, then I don't get to cast atrocity. Insolent cur. This is my choice. Uh. Well, they're wait, they're tapped out. Well, by tapped out, I mean they only have two mana, which is not going to be enough. What you believe. Uh, we could just let this happen first. Get them a little lower. Boom! Got the atrocity combo. Alright, 15 2. Yeah, that's a big boy. So yeah, that's that's an awesome finisher. It's six mana. Whenever you play, it's a one one, but it gets plus one plus one for every creature that you have died during the game. So we had nine creatures die during the game, so it enters in as a ten ten. Don't need a second aristoc aristocrat. Hello. What's that noise? We're gonna hapless haplessly attack for one. I must get out of here. Yeah, and then yep. We're then we're playing six mana fling. Yeah, atrocity is just is fling. So that's our that's our combo. I've they who endure with fling. Like you have no idea. Um we, we shall not rest until all of this rains. No, 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 no. They didn't block. I was attacking for zero though.
All right, first card for Callista to see die. That's a good card. Sorry, right, they didn't fall for it. So I have eight cards over there. Interesting. Did he even block the one one? sense well it doesn't make sense why they didn't block the one one if they're just going to ruination oh i guess because callista would have transformed I didn't even really realize that Callista was that close to transforming, honestly. Now we just need to draw another Callista. And then we can actually attack with a flipped Callista. The, the thing they said would never happen. We could actually do it if we draw another Callista. However impro improbable that may be. A tribute to the Spire God. Oh, this Iceborne Legacy is so slow. all these cards just to get this to resolve even though everything's just gonna die all right but now future spiralings will have plus two plus two Ooh. i definitely want to have the 12 man available so i can have they who endure and, and have it my fling um can't just kill it to see four five six seven eight nine ten eleven well still i don't think they'll have a five mana card that kills this so i think we're good what do they have like they 
have to block with Hecarim. I still don't think they're going to have five mana do six damage. Yeah. Thanks, Puncher. Yeah, thanks, chat. Thanks for, for thinking atrocity. Getting those good vibes. That's why we drew it. Now, of course, Vengeance ruins my plan. Ooh. These are all 4-3 spiders. <laughs> yeah, I do use very MTG vocabulary still. So I know I have like an, still have like an MTG audience to try to make it uh, yeah, easy for my audience to understand also. Virtue guides me. So five mana. Yeah, they shouldn't have anything five mana to do six damage. They're, you know, no, no vengeance anymore. So I think I'm just safe to do this. Boom. Seven and two. We're twenty two and fifteen on the day, right? Oh, no, that's not right. Uh, let's do a little quick math. We're sixteen losses and 23 uh, 23 and 16 yeah that adds up to 39 so we're 23 and 16 and we still dropped we still dropped 30 slots um maybe not as far as is Callista necessary in the deck maybe not we finally got to transform Callista whenever Callista died we have we've transformed Callista like twice. We've never attacked with the transform Callista. We're not that lucky. Would be a good substitution. Um What you looking for? <clears throat> Could go with basically just other cards that kind of cost that same amount of mana. Could stop, Harvey. You don't want something that to, that to replace it with something that costs like five, because there's a whole lot of five drops in the deck. You want to replace it with. Something that costs less than that. So you'd want to replace it with something else that costs three or four mana. Um, so that's why I don't think you'd want to replace it with like Thresh. I mean, you could could play like Ash, I guess. If you have Ashes. I mean, that's just another champion. But besides that. play this um maybe maybe wraith caller i don't know how many i don't know how much freljord we have in the deck if you can play wraith caller Awakening. Let's get some spiders. Boo.
Oh, yeah, you're right. Do have a rematch here against Liquid Hype. We'll bring peace to Ionia. I don't remember if we won or lost last time. I think we lost. Oh, we won? Sweet. Yeah, see, I'd been, I'd been, you know, such a, you know, been just paying attention to magic for the last, you know, like 10 years and stuff, not really knowing other stuff. So, like, I don't even know, like, you said, yeah, so it's not, you know, you said, like, that's, you know, the person's name's Hyped, he's from Team Liquid. I actually don't really know what Team Liquid is. Do I vile, I kind of want to vile feast my own hapless aristocrat to get a, to get a 3-3. You know, we get two three threes. I guess it's better to vile feast this thing and get a three three, right? I'm not sure, honestly. Yeah, get rid of one of their blockers. Start as StarCraft Wait, two team. They're big in DOTA two and League of Legends. Awesome. Okay, massive organization organization has many teams across many games. Gotcha. Peace has its cost. By force of will. Peace has its cost. This is them going down to, they go down to two if they make this block. They go go to four if they block the other spider. So they're at two, I got this atrocity. I'm in a pretty decent spot right now. <laughs> what pretty decent, I mean I'm very far ahead. I always think, like, when I think Karma, I'm, I'm always thinking all these Shadow Isles cards that are going to be, could be playing, like Withering Whale and Grasp of the Undying and Ruination and stuff like that. And then I'm like, oh, wait, no, it's, it's P and Z with Ionia, so they don't have that kind of card draw. So basically, we have to worry about Deny. Deny is the card that we got to be worried about. Well, that and I just, I just tapped out of my Atrocity. That was probably a dumb idea. All this talk of liquid, remind me that I'm thirsty. I need to drink some water. They cannot hide. First blood. Will of Ionia, got to worry about that too. So Deny and Will of Ionia. Those are two cards they could have. That would break up an atrocity combo. Come on, kill the 1-1. One -one. The Order rewards its faithful. I'm a 
must get out of here. It's too late for you. By force of will. Making an attack like this means that if they want to do the barrier lifesteal stuff, they have to block the the cheap creatures and do barrier lifesteal and not the like the, the worst creatures and not block the better creatures. Thanks, Aaron. GG. Alright, so we finished 8 and 2 with Iceborne Spiders. Honestly, a lot better than I thought. I, I honestly didn't think that we would... I honestly thought this was like the weakest of the four decks that we were playing today before the stream. You know, like whenever we were going in, I thought this was going to be the, the weak deck. Um, but, you know, the other ones, we finished 5, 5, 5, 5, 6, 4, and now 8 and 2. Um... Atrocity was great for us. We won a lot of games on Atrocity. We top decked Atrocity at like really good times over and over. And so we were so basically I think that we were pretty fortunate with our eight and two record because of that. Um The Brood Awakening looked good at five mana. It looked good. The box was a good removal spell. Um Elixir of Iron actually did a lot of work for us over there. But uh Iceborne Legacy wasn't too bad. It was worse than... Like, I think it would be better as a three-mana card. And there was a couple of times where it would have been better as a three-mana card. Um, yeah, basically, I think if it, this was still the three-mana one-one, that would have been that would have been better. Um, Callisto, you know, like, is just kind of in, in the deck. It's not bad. It's just kind of in the deck. Uh, somebody asked, like, what to replace Callisto with if you know, don't have the... Don't want to play the... You know, don't want to use the champion wild cards on it. Um, I don't know about Chronicler of Ruin. Probably not Chronicler of Ruin. Do you have enough Shadow Isles for? Oh yeah, there's a lot of Shadow Isles in here. Maybe just Wraith Caller. You're at, like you're at. Yeah, I think Wraith Caller could be a good idea. But I guess, I guess Wraith Caller does really does. Um, it does muck up the board for your brood awakening and stuff so maybe not maybe you just want like some you probably want a creature i don't know rhyme fang wolf uh the extension hasn't updated yet i'm not sure maybe you do have to just Sorry, maybe you do just have to play more fives, and even though these things are five, you can play them like with spell mana with five. Maybe you just play Thresh. That's probably the best option, honestly, is just playing Thresh. Or you could go big and try to have, you know, like Rasa or Ledros or Harrowing or something big like that. I don't think that would would be as good though. But anyway, yeah, those are I don't know, those are the little little suggestions. I do kind of feel like you want a unit. Like the deck has a lot of spells. It has 24 spells, 16 units. I think you need to whatever you replace Callista with, it's got to be a unit. Um it maybe just Rhymefang Wolf is just the thing to do, is just get those in. Um I don't know. Babbling Bjerg wouldn't really hit unless, like, Babbling Bjerg would get your late game They Who Endure. Um, wouldn't draw anything originally, but could get that in the late game for you. 
Anyway, there we go. That's Iceborne Spiders. Surprisingly good. That's what I have to say about the deck. Surprisingly good. Um, I still wish they didn't change Iceborne Legacy, but the Brood Awakening change was good. All right, those of y'all watching on YouTube, hit that like button over there and leave a comment. Let me know what you think of the deck. If you're trying it yourself, let me know how it's going. If you have a good idea for uh, what to replace Callista with, if you don't have the champion wild cards, you know, feel free to put a, a comment down below if you have a good suggestion. Um, yeah, those likes and comments really do help the YouTube videos, uh, you know, with their algorithms, them reach more people. So please uh, hit that like button and leave a comment. I'd really appreciate it. All right, but that's it here for Iceborne Spiders. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you for the next video.